Hey y'all, I'm back. <laughs> um, this is the what I heard. I was um chilling, but you know, doing me, and then I heard this. So I was like, oh, this is a message here. <sighs> what I heard was the more they heckle you, the more they try to badger you, um, harass you heckle you okay the more powerful you become okay so continue to transmute <laughs> that negative energy they clowns they they are clowns okay they got the red nose on and everything child all right but just continue to transmute that clowns heckling their negative energy that's what i heard so somebody needs to hear that and the candle just went out. Think about your life ahead, child. Child boo about these fools, these clowns. Somebody is a straight clown and you just have to say, not my clowns, not my circus, and look, move on to the life ahead, okay? Holy Spirit, any other oracle messages here? Any other oracle messages here? Anything else that we need to know? We have snake. Hmm. Happiness ahead that came out. Two on the top. Any final messages? Any final messages? What's done in the dark will come to light. That's back out here. Because see, once again, people don't know how to sit down. And we have alcoholism and drug abuse. We're going to pull this out. Because people don't know how to sit down. Someone is still out here heckling people. Still creating fake accounts. Still moving around with this snake energy. Possibly somebody who is experiencing alcohol and drug abuse. Okay, they probably get high. Is what I'm hearing. They get high and then they go in this heckle mode. Okay, but what's done in the dark is going to come to light. Okay, the life ahead, what this person has been doing, they're going to be exposed. They're going to continue to be exposed. So child, just continue to transmute that negative energy because you're growing more powerful. The more and more they try to gang stalk you, heckle you, harass you, come at you. With this Knight of Wands energy, try to stop you, um, shut you down with this Eight of Swords energy, shut you up, have you in this Five of Cups energy, okay? I'm telling you, the more they come at you with this, this type of energy <laughs> and collaborate with others to do so, they playing themselves. I'm telling you, you're still going to remain the Queen of Pentacles. You're still going to shine. You're still transmuting this energy into something fruitful and abundant for yourself. And you're still going to continue to celebrate. Okay? And what they're doing in the dark is going to come to light. You're going to have justice. Just keep letting them play. Keep letting the clown be a clown. Okay? Refuse to allow that to take you off kilter in any way. Okay, remain poised, remain gracious. Lay low. That's what I'm hearing. Stop giving these people energy. Okay, continue to use what the, what is happening, use their behavior, and be an alchemist. Use your experiences dealing with this type of energy to help others like you're doing. Continue to speak your truth, your truth. Continue to speak the truth because every time that you share your wisdom, every time you stick to your morals, every time you remain gracious and you think about the life of he life ahead of you and you not playing into this energy, it causes a tire moment in these people's life, <laughs> okay? <laughs> they ask, come apart. 
it, it really has them fucked up. They trying to keep you in this Eight of Swords energy, but I'm telling you, continue to let them heckle and do what they do because every time it's like they don't get it. That's why I think they're the ones who's actually bound. They think they binding you. They bound, They have bound themselves to heckling you, to gang stalking you, to obsessing over you, to coming at you with this erratic, I mean, just erratic emotional energy. They're just, I mean, they just move without thinking, moving without, without a conscience, moving without thought to what they're saying and doing. Just, you know, doing shit. This Queen of Cups energy, possibly a water sign here. So again, continue to this person also what I'm picking up with this cherry and this Queen of Cups energy. This person does have some, I'm telling you, this person got some alcoholism and drug abuse issues with this five of wands here. They are um, definitely diff dealing with some inner conflict in their mind, some mental conflict, some physical issues. They are, they are in combat with a lot of people, but they're trying to go to war with you. They're trying to help you, but they definitely have at least five different issues, significant issues that they are facing right now. And one of them is alcoholism or drug abuse. This person has other things that they need to be focused on, but they, for some reason, want to gang stalk you, want to bother you, want to be on your shit so hard so ignore elevate okay and expose with this strip card and the sun card i can't make it up continue to elevate with this strength card continue to stay strong continue to remain in your power and continue to expose their ass with the sun card that's what the holy spirit wants you to do because what is done in the dark is going to come to light no matter what they do, okay, no matter how they move with the snake energy here, because they got issues. And I believe this alcoholism and this drug abuse is what's fueling their behavior. This is what's causing them to act this way. But this is going to end one way or the other with this death card here. Here, excuse me. This is going to be over with soon. Child's like, you are not supposed to come into the new year on this same shit. If you came into the new year still trying to spiritually attack people, heckle people, gang stalk people, and you've been doing this for a while to people, okay? You playing, and you didn't play long enough, okay? And balance is about to be brought to your life with this death card here, okay? What's done in the dark is about to come to light. This person can't get enough. We have the King of Pentacles here. It may possibly be a King of Pentacles energy who is heckling you. I'm picking up on hev heavy heckling energy. You are in the spotlight somehow. And this person will not stop trying to... I'm just picking up on like little petty things that they're trying to do to aggravate you or harass you, or intimidate you. I don't know what they call this that I'm picking up on, but I'm calling it heckling because it's so minute, minute and it's not effective at all, okay? It's like, oh, okay, anyway, it's that type of energy, but it's just the fact that they're doing it because they're doing it thinking that they're really having some kind of effect on you. That's what I'm picking up here, but that's that drug abuse fucking with their brain, okay? Like I said, that's that drug abuse with this moon card here. That's all them illusions and stuff. Cancer energy here. We got cancer out here twice again. Here go this cancer, y'all. Child boo. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This cancer energy back out here. But the, all that alcoholism and drug abuse got them that brain in, you know, kind of mushy. Okay, this nine of swords here. That mind ain't right. I'm telling you. <laughs> Lord, Holy Spirit. 
I'm about to close this reading now. I ain't finna do this, child. Holy Spirit, what are the final messages here? Illusions, y'all. Drug addiction. But it's all coming to an end soon. 1010 on the phone. I'm telling you, what is done in the dark is about to come to light. It's going to be fully illuminated to the point where this person who is harassing you, okay, we got, I, I'm picking up on two energies out here, a masculine and a feminine. I just did a reading on a masculine and feminine couple who was trying to confuse and stop some type of medium or tarot reader from exposing people. And now we got this energy, possibly a king of pentacles and this moon chariot energy here out here still trying to heckle somebody here it's definitely a water sign the female is for sure she a water sign out here trying to heckle people still okay still trying to aggravate and harass whoever this is because of what they're saying what they're exposing with this strength and this sun card here Okay. And whatever you're whatever they're doing, you are transmuting it. You are literally being an alchemist with this Queen of Pentacles energy. Whatever they try to do against you from the very beginning, you have been transmuting that energy and being it makes you more intuitive. It makes you more powerful. It's like they almost helping you get better. And they don't see it. So that's why I'm saying you can't even be worried about it, child. Any final messages, Holy Spirit? Because they helping you out. They making you stronger, wiser, definitely more intuitive. Um, they are definitely elevating you. Okay? To this Ten of Cups energy. All right? They are definitely placing you where you're going to be set. Okay? Because... What's happening is you're taking that negativity and you are using it to fuel productivity in other aspects in your life, okay? And those things that you are putting effort into, they're going to produce an Ace of Cups for you. Definitely a Ten of Cups. You finna have your house, your land, by the sea, okay? If you know, you know. You about to have Whatever you want, how you want it, and these people know it, <laughs> okay? That's why they're heckling you, because that's all they can do. They can't stop these blessings that God has for you, but they're definitely helping you increase the level of abundance that's about to come into your life. So, Chabu, you know the life that you got ahead of you. Continue to let these people do what they're going to do. Transmute that energy and continue to do you. Okay, I hope this message helps somebody. I really do. I hope this gives you some insight and clarification to just not even worry about these people. They slow. They slow. Handle like this. This Queen of Swords. Ignore anyway. Okay, let them. They blocked. I can't make it up. They blocked. That's why all they can do is hide behind fake accounts and create all kind of shit to try to harass you in the dark. They can't show their face. They will never approach you directly, honey. I promise you that. They're going to continue to hide in the dark, but that shit going to be exposed. Wow, I was about to stop, but the Holy Spirit wants y'all to know what's done in the dark is coming to light. So, child boo, these people are going to be forced to walk away. 14, 14 on the phone. Let them do what they're going to do. Keep doing you. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. I'll be back with another one, y'all. Peace.